Let's balance the equation for BiCl3 plus H2S. First thing we need to do is count the atoms up. One bismuth, three chlorine, two hydrogen, and one sulfur. Product side, we have two of the BiCl1, H1, and sulfur. Three of those. It looks like we could try to balance the bismuth first by putting it two here. One times two, that would give us two of those. Two goes to everything here, so the so three times the two, that would give us six of those. Let's try the chlorine. So we could put a six in front of the HCl. One times six, that would balance the chlorines. And then one hydrogen times the six, we'd have six hydrogen atoms. Looks like if we just put a three here in front of the hydrogen sulfide, two times three, that would balance the hydrogens. And one times three, that would balance the sulfur atoms. And we would be done. This is the balanced equation for BiCl3 plus H2S. If we wanted to look at the type of reaction, it looks like the hydrogen and the bismuth, they change places. So instead of BiCl, we get BiS3 here, Bi2S3. And the hydrogen, instead of being with the sulfur, the hydrogen's now with the chlorine. So I would call this a double displacement reaction. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.